Hey, what's happening, guys? No, we're not talking about the Tesla coil again today, but we are going to use it as an example because today we are talking about this beauty right here. This is the Kaiweets KTI K01 handheld touchscreen infrared camera. That's right. It is all very nice and pretty and touchscreeny. So let me get set up for a nice shot for you. Okay. Currently, we're just looking at an overhead view of the Tesla coil. Now we're going to take a look kind of through this phone screen here as best as I can make this work. There, that is not terrible. All right, so the Tesla coil currently is not on. This is my screwdriver. Right here I am pointing at the um, potentiometer. Here is the LED. Here is uh, the first tip 41 and then the second one is behind it. Kind of over here is our big capacitor and then we have our power inputs down there. So let's put 12 volts through this and you should see things heat up rather quickly okay it is on and oscillating things are definitely starting to heat up there look at that board all that red coming in there the colors are changing very quickly even take a look at the uh, primary coil wire back here it's starting to show some heat let's see if we can't uh, put our dingleberry on it Did I lose it? There we go. Come on. Kind of hard to get it on there. All right, I'm going to shut this off before we burn things up. Now, what you're looking at here is simply the infrared view, the IR view. Now, if I touch the screen, it is a touch screen, and we come here to our image mode, there is the visible light. And this is a cool mode. This is a picture in a picture. So what, we, what we're looking at here is visible light to kind of give you an idea of what you're looking at. But we have a centered area, you know, right here that is showing the infrared. I think that is super, super cool. What do you guys think? Let me know down below. So another way we can come in here is MIF, which is, whoops, back to the right one, multi-spectral imaging. So what we're getting here is a little bit of infrared, a little bit of visible light, kind of everything mixed together. Let's go back. We'll go back to... Uh, Oops. Touch screen. It's touchy. Go back to infrared. Now, the next one over here we have is this button, which is object analysis. We can set a, um, a point or a box, and we can set it up so that it tracks the object, and we can set a maximum um, heat level for the object. And if it goes above that, it'll give us an alarm. Now over here we have our different palettes. We have Arctic, Rainbow, Hot Iron, Iron Red, Black Heat, and White Heat. I kind of like the rainbow myself. We also have a uh, flash on the front. And then in here we have our settings. You can go through all of them. Um, also featured on the front of the camera, let me turn this around here.
we have here our visible light camera followed by a laser rangefinder above it over here we have a laser sight and the infrared camera and then on top we have the power button and a shutter button that will allow us to take pictures all very cool like I said touchscreen comes in a really nice package can't beat it the price is a little bit spicy I'll put a link to it down below but um, if this is something that you know you need to use for your business you know or your hobby or whatever you know a few hundred dollars is not so bad I guess let's fire up the Tesla coil again here and this time I'm going to bring the camera up here and let's take a look at what is going on on top so our fluorescent tube there showing a little bit of light a little bit of heat there at the uh, electrodes that's interesting that right there in the middle of that coil is the hottest part very interesting come up here and see so you can get a better view for you if it'll focus focus yeah there you go there's the circuit there's the coil pretty cool all right guys i would like to thank kai Wheats for sending out their brand new kti k01 handheld touchscreen thermal camera for our consideration very cool and i'd like to thank you guys for watching i mean i wouldn't be making these videos if you weren't watching them so thank you very much for watching and i'd like to thank all the patrons who keep this channel going if you're not yet a patron please check the link down below um really helps keep things going every penny counts so thank you guys all very much i hope you enjoyed this if you did give me a thumbs up feel free to comment share and don't forget to subscribe big thanks to all the patrons big thanks to you guys that's it i'm out peace